Hey Aquarius, what the fuck is up? What's up, y'all? I had to me a um a nap. I was eating this shit. I was watching Station Night. I think it's eighteen or nineteen, whatever it's called. That's my show. Why this little piece of hair right here won't make it do what it want to do? I don't know. Anyways, we're going to go ahead and get right into this reading, y'all. If you definitely want to like this video, comment, subscribe, and, you know, support your girl. I would definitely appreciate it. Everything you need to know about me, contacting me, booking the reading, all that stuff is definitely down below, okay? So, let's get into this, y'all. I think I have some space on my iPad. I don't think it's going to act funny. So, let's get into this. We're going to go ahead and pull some cards, and I'm going to see what message we have for y'all today. All right. I know y'all been waiting for my messages, but sometimes Spirit be telling me don't drop them on that day. Sorry. Okay. <coughs> Number six. I'm coughing and shit. Um, throat kind of tangly. Trying to block my throat chakra. Anyways, we have excuses, excuses, excuses. Okay. Y'all, y'all know the beaver sound. That's my tea. Leaking by school. He is a Virgo. We get six cards for y'all. Okay. Perspective. Okay. These are my confessions. I have still had some growing to do. Okay. Divine intervention. So we got six cards. I'm going to try to get three more to get a little bit more attention or a little bit more, you know, details for y'all. All right. Um, let's see what's going on. They know more than you think. Okay. Oh, shit. I thought they were my soulmate. So either you thought this or this person thought this. They were my true soulmate. Excuse me. Money laundering, cleaning money. All right. So this is gonna be a real interesting reading. It is very general. Use your intuition to your own God. Don't get on here saying it's not your full story, baby. Because I'm just giving y'all the messages. Okay, the thread is giving me. Okay, and don't get on here asking me why I got on, why I got on my cars. Okay, I'm telling y'all, whenever I make new cars, Spirit tell me to make new cars. I don't sit around and make new cars every single day. Period. Like that's just period. I be asking some shit, and I be like, now why the fuck you ask that? Same way you get your downloads, same way I get my downloads. Okay. So, y'all, it's gonna be a very interesting message. Whoever this person is. They're either a distorted masculine or feminine, or somebody here that you've had a past life with, or you shared some um some uh, either a past with, or you guys have been, you know, enjoying past times together. This person here, I feel like whenever they talk to you, or whenever you ask them something, or whatever something comes up, they always has an excuse. It could be as simple as excuses why they can't do something for you, why they can't meet you somewhere, why they can't take you somewhere, why they can't something. And I say can't, yeah, can't. Can't same fucking thing. Y'all know what I'm talking about, okay? <coughs> yeah, I just feel like whoever this person is, they more than they do. They know more than you think. So the reason why they make excuses, or <coughs> people go making excuses for them, or maybe you make excuses for them. I feel like they have this energy where they play dumb. And this is somebody who likes to play dumb, act like they don't know, or they're slow, or, you know, they have your learning disability, or whatever the fuck it is. This is somebody who acts like this, but they know more than you think they do. All right. <coughs> I don't know why I'm getting this coughing energy, like my throat shock is, like, going through some weird shit. Okay? But anyways, <coughs> y'all, this is some real weird shit. It's like my throat shock is being, like, mm, weird. Anyway, like I said, some information about to be leaked here about this person. And they still got some growing to do. I'm getting like, you know, they're not as solid as you think. They're not as tough as you think. They're not whatever. They're, this person has a lot of growing to do. They have a lot of more karmic cycles or cycles to learn shit about them um, to do here. But <coughs> this person kept giving you excuses, 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 excuses. Or whatever these excuses are, either you're telling them, this person's telling them. Or there was always an excuse here that they told you because they knew more than what you thought. Okay. And, you know... They did these because you, they were seeing things from a different perspective than you was, or they had to have a perspective, perspective change here. This is why they went through in a divine intervention here, or you had a divine intervention with this person and vice versa. All right. And they still got some going to group. So this is why they're going through a divine intervention. Okay. This could be like a tower moment, a make or break time. We are a good one or a bad one here, but I feel like it's neutral, but 
this person was always making excuses for you. So I really feel like whenever you ask them to do whatever, whatever, you know, they never really knew why. Like <coughs> somebody could be saying like, oh, they calling me into work. Why are they calling you to work at this time? Oh, <coughs> I don't know. They just doing this whole time. It was more going on. We said, ah, they could be like, you could be asking them like, why you can't do this? Or why they doing this? Or why whatever? And they'll be like, oh, I don't know. This net net playing dumb, but they know the real reason why. Like, let's say somebody saying you chilling with somebody. Oh, um, <coughs> my job called me in to come to work. It's 11 o'clock at night. Why would your job call you in to come in, come to work at 11 o'clock at night? I don't know. The whole time somebody else calling them to do something else or whatever it is. Okay, and I have likes petite things. So they first get like petite bodies or many, many or miniature things here. <coughs> I'm sorry, y'all. I do not mean to be coughing like this on the camera. I don't know why the fuck I'm coughing like this. <coughs> Having like a coffee fit or some shit. Like, uh-uh, I don't like that. After this video, I'm going to get me some tea. Matter of fact, <coughs> oh, let me get me some tea now. That's nasty. My bad, y'all. That cough fuck was fucking disgusting. I had to get that shit right for y'all ass. But, like I said, there's somebody here who like petite things. They like little Yorkies, little mini things. They like skinny things, little slim, thick motherfuckers, shit like that. Petite thing as a whole can go so many different ways, okay? But this person here, they acting like, um, how do you say, they didn't know what the hell was going on, but they knew more than you think here. You had a divine intervention, or they did. I'm getting cut off your fingers to save your hand here. They realized that they had to do that here, or it was a little, it was a little too late. <clears throat> yeah. It's an elaborate scheme to expose you, okay? So that's what I thought, because we got the leaking card here. Whoever this person was, they tried to, like, expose you. Or tell your business that make you look bad or whatever this is. Like, this is some crazy shit. They had elaborate ass skin. Like, they would always make excuses on their perspective. Why they thought this or why they thought that. Or why they wasn't around you. Or why they was doing the things that they were doing here. But it's because they knew more than you think here. You didn't know what the scheme was. The scheme was to expose you. Or to make you be exposed to tell your business or leak your secrets or embarrass you here. But this person did this because they still have some going through. This person was emotionally immature here, giving Page of Cups vibes. There's somebody who would act like they fuck with you, they were solid or, you know, whatever it was. But they still leaking or they got a hole in their ass. Like I said, it's somebody who can't hold water. You got to tell this person something here. And, um, yeah, they expose you. Mm-hmm. Again, the person got canceled. The person got canceled. Whatever they tried to do here to get you canceled or whatever it is, this person got canceled. Also, I feel like this person here, there was another person involved here. I like that they had that was really making them either do these things or you know that they was working with or whatever it is. But this other person here, they had a divine submission with this person because I feel like they still had grown to do, but this person was involved with they was either cleaning money or money laundering or doing some type of scheme here with money. When I say money laundering, I mean like <clears throat> um cleaning money. Or, like, you know, somehow, some way, making dirty money look like clean money, okay? Like, let's say somebody's selling drugs, right? Somebody can make, like, the money they got from drugs look clean by putting it in the bank account or doing whatever here, okay? Yeah, I feel like you got good karma coming in from this situation or from whatever it is here. <clears throat> wow, this is some crazy shit. Just cut off your finger to save your hand, okay? So, like I said, this is... Then what was this scheme here to expose you? This is something from a past person here. And like I said, the sun car. You could have been the sun here. You know how they say, here comes the sun. Do, 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 do. Or, you know, ain't no sunshine when she's gone. This person could have wanted to expose you here. But I just really feel like they did this for their own personal enjoyment. There was really not a motive here. Like, what was the motive? Yeah, Page of Pentacles. This person either felt like you had more than them or page of pentacles they were really like holding back bread from you are they just did this for their personal enjoyment here i'm getting to big up their self-worth i'm getting big up yourself somebody could be like a different ethnicity like jamaican or haitian or some type of something here because i just got go and big up yourself go on and big up yourself go on and big up yourself like somebody like you know go ahead and big up yourself they wanted to make themselves look larger than you better than you or whatever it is here but why because i feel like <laughs> two of wands they had a decision here to make either they expose you or they make you look bad or tear you down or i'm getting let leak your secrets or try to expose your deep dark depths here or seven of wands <clears throat> you know what i'm saying or seven of wands struggle to be on top situation it's like the, that was the only way 
they had a decision to make here. Either be on your side and be exposed just like you. Because somebody had a girl member, they were being blackmailed or something like that. They could seven of wands and eight of pentacles here. Either one, they could work alongside you. All right. And you could be on top situation. Y'all both could. Y'all could be helping each other out. All right. Or they could be exposed like you. Because the person still has some growing to do here. So this is either when they were going through a spiritual awakening, when they were coming of age, or when they were getting their minds together, or when their frontal lobe was actually still maturing, or, you know, whatever it is. That's what it is. Wow, that's crazy. So what was, what was exposed? Like, I'm confused. Like, what was this about... What is this exposure regarding here? Like, what did they not want to get exposed here for them to switch up and expose you? So they didn't want to get exposed their private relationships, like who they were sleeping with here, who they were probably involved with. Okay, I don't thought like this is a lover of yours. It could be, but I'm getting more friendship, coworker, social circle vibes, family member. I'm getting those type of vibes here. Yeah, situations are about to explode. They didn't want this to explode in their face, so they rather explode, your, blow up your camp instead of blowing up their own spot. Okay, yeah, and then run away from the scene. So, <clears throat> yeah, they made bad choices concerning it. Whatever bad choices they made, because there was a hater here who asked them. They chose to make a bad choice with this hater energy here, even though you was the real diamond in the rough or you was born to shine. Um, they chose to go with this hater here and do this shit but with the nine of swords at the bottom of the deck here they were sad as fuck when they did this they were going through anxiety they felt like they were shitty a shitty person shitty individual they felt like shit yeah magician card i'm getting you wanted this or you manifested this i'm getting like you were the magician you were more powerful than me was stronger than me. your light was brighter than them or whatever it was <clears throat> somehow you reigned over them and you know nine of swords energy this person felt like shit because i'm getting even though they tried to expose or do whatever that shit backfired or it was um canceled or like i said you got good karma from that shit period free publicity but it's like nine of swords this person feels so bad here because it's like i need all that shit to save myself because we got cut off your finger to save your hand they cut you off you was one of their fingers to save their whole hand but not realizing that their hand still had to get cut off because even though they cut their finger off guess what they cut the pointer finger off. Cut the thumb off. So, you know, without a thumb, you just got you a paw, baby. Yeah, with the Nine of Swords energy, the Lover's card and the World card. I'm getting like, when it happened, everything elevated for you. Or they thought that the world was going to go around what they asked. But they end up still having to go through their own demise. They still end up being exposed or blown up here. Yeah, Three of Wands energy here and the Hangman. This could definitely be somebody who's a Gemini or a Pisces or an Earth sign. Okay. Yeah, but whoever this person is, it's like they try to expose you or your secrets or whatever you told them. I'm hearing at least I'm safe inside my mind, like um, SpongeBob says. But, child, they did this shit and they thought they was going to be the cherry card energy and move straight forward here. But like I said, this person would always give you multiple excuses on who they was hanging with, why they couldn't fuck with you, why they couldn't do this, why they couldn't do that. Because they was too busy running off with whatever you told them in confidence or whatever they knew about you or whatever secrets are going to expose. Um, for somebody, it could be your living situation that was going to be exposed. Or for some of you guys, it could be like your sexual preference. I don't know why I'm getting it's their sexual preference for some of them. For some of you guys here, it was who they was fucking with in a private relationship here or something was going to be exposed to that person. For other of you, it was because of their sexual preference. Okay, um, so they chose to expose you. Okay, um, but it's like when they expose you, I really feel like they exposed your, like, your home situation or exposed something here that meant a lot to you, but it wasn't that deep or it was, what is this? Yeah, it just it, it, it was just too much. But the person always gave you excuses here because they knew the plan. They knew all along. They knew who they were dealing with here. And they had you on the back burner or they really sacrificed you. It's why they had a divine intervention here. And Spirit was like, you know what? You got some motherfucking nerve trying to do some shit. But like I said, you still got some growing to do. So I'm going to show you what type of growing you finna go through. Okay? Like I said, they had to have a perspective change because all that shit that they did, they realizing that that person here, they thought the person was a soulmate. Or somebody who was, a, who was part of a soul path, a soul journey, who was really fucking with them, they dog. I'm getting, that's my dog for sure. Like, you know what I'm saying? They could have thought that or whatever. I'm hearing that song, I got a thing for you, baby, you know. I don't want to take it slow. I want to get to know you. It could have been the energy about this person or this person, like, I'm getting seduced them. I'm getting, like, snake trauma vibes. This person seduced them like that. Yeah, like I said, they knew more than what they let on here. Hmm. What did they try to expose here for my collective, Aquarius? 
<sighs> they could have tried to expose here your finances, okay? When I say King of Pentacles, this is like your finances, your stability, your home life, you know, things that actually matter, your credit score, all right? Who you are beefing with here, why you have problems with somebody, he said, she said. They were exposing these things here about you, okay? Yeah, also with the full card, they were exposing what made you feel foolish here. I'm getting your weak spot to what made you feel like, you know... How do you say she was a fool? Like that she was stupid or made you feel like, you know, things that you were naive about or things that, you know, people, a lot of people were naive about here and, unless they knew you personally. Okay. Um, last card, like I said, but whatever they exposed to, they could even expose something either about your sex life here, about like, I'm getting your power moves here. Yeah. And it's like, they left you in an energy where you knew you either, you either didn't know that they exposed you. Or I'm getting when, when you found this out, you didn't really know what to do or what to think here. Yeah, nine of cups. All because they wanted some money, some some something something to feel smug or pleased about here. Wow. Okay, Ace of Wands energy here. There's somebody here who likes skinny petite things. This person can like slim thick females or males or skinny men or you know slim or slim thick females or you know petite things like you know miniature things here or mini things period like you know mini juices miniature actual videos or instagram or like i said miniature miniature poodle miniature schnauzer yorkie dawson somehow petite or small things okay are of significance here but this person had to go through a divine intervention here and when they went through this divine intervention child two of pentacles here they were so overwhelmed they was out of breath they was crying they were saying why me and they did they realized oh i know why me Seven of Pentacles because that plan that I had for that motherfucker blew up in my face, okay, with the tower car energy. And they realized that's why they was going through the tower here. Or they realized them causing a tire moment for you or trying to. I feel like they call it a tire moment, but it wasn't like it, like it was like a small tower. Like, let's say you think the whole building on fire, but it's only like three out of five rooms, four out of five rooms, and the building can be savaged. Um, salvaged, okay. The person was a savage here. They tried to be a savage. Yeah, but I feel like um, Leo energy, like I said, they didn't do shit but cause conflict with you. Okay, and they made you feel like, damn, I thought I knew you. Hold on, wait, bitch, who you? Like Beauty and the Beast energy, she thought she knew him whole time. That nigga wasn't even a, a thing. He, was, he, wasn't, he wasn't even a beast. He was a fucking man. So like I said, you thought you knew this person here, but you didn't know them. The star card, they didn't think that she was going to bounce back from this. I'm getting like, you knew them. But you started getting all this unwanted attention here, all right? Or, you know, you could get a lot of attention or, you know, free publicity or whatever it is. I'm getting star card. You were still able to rebuild yourself, rejuvenate. I'm getting restore yourself to your former glory here. With three of pentacles here, the person that this person was working against you with or working with um somebody, the person who is working with here, this little somebody, a person, hierophant card, the ancestors could have warned them of this here. This person here th thought they had authority over this person. That's why they acted in this way because they have some type of authority or blackmailing or something over this person here. Like I said, they blew up your camp here because they didn't want to blow up their own camp. We got the tower card that's on fire, okay, and we got the blow it up card, okay? Like I said, three is two worse, but they realized that whoever this person was they was dealing with here, they either deceived them too or they hurt them too. And they like, damn, I did all this. I blew up their camp and you still hurt me. You still deceived me or somehow some way you still put up put a shots fired to the, straight to the heart like i said and they still had to go through judgment for not only the shit that they did but i'm getting for their wrongdoings and for them not listening to your spiritual team here okay with the emperor energy here and now this person here they want to get this emperor energy they could have had a perspective change yeah because they were the knight of wands before with the five of cups here or they're currently being the knight of wands here like i said the Five of Cups and Nine of Pentacles. You end up being Nine of Pentacles here, okay? And they still end up being a Page of Cup with a false ass, okay? Like I said, you're not even caring about them. You got your spirit guys. You got your money. You got your power. You got your respect here. I'm getting you took your L, but it was a lesson for you. But this person, I'm getting like you. You going from a Nine of Pentacles here to a Temperance card, balance everything being fair, just and balanced. I'm getting that song by um, Mac Miller. Sexy, nasty, has no guidelines. It's called god god fair sexy sexy nasty i don't know it's on the divine feminine album okay r.i.p him i love mac miller but yeah this is either a confirmation this is what's going on or what happened already but yeah 
whoever the fuck this person was who they was dealing with here, it was somebody who was blackmailing them, somebody here who knew more about them, somebody here who threatened either to expose them or was holding something underneath their head, okay? And somehow you were involved. I feel like you were third party or onlooker, or you were like important to this person, but somehow either the other person had a rivalry and was hating on you, and they like told this person, either you do it or I do it, okay? Some shit like that. Yeah, it's like the higher fan of judgment card, either you do it or I do it. The universe is like, either you listen to them or you're going to go through judgment for listening to them. Okay, and they still did what they did. Yeah, King of Wands. This person was in the King of Wands energy when they're around this person, but they were in a page energy around you. Yeah, Eight of Swords, but they was constantly in their head here because they didn't want to take this offer. They may not have wanted to do this here. I'm getting, they thought about it like, damn, I shouldn't really be doing this, but I got to do it because they was in their own head about their own secrets or whatever they was this private relationship here they had with somebody or sexual um orientation or whatever it is being exposed here and not a wands they were battered and bruised they were tired of going around and around in their head okay around and around and around and around we go who was that adele that could be significance okay but yeah i have seven of cups here i have the nine of swords and the lovers card this person was like, shit, I might as well because, you know, you never know. I'm, I might get some, you know, new doors open up. I'm getting, if I blow that shit up, you know, shit will actually look better for me. Wrong. Now the source energy. Bitch, you go over here crying and shit and you in another karma cycle with this person here who you thought was fucking with you. Who you thought was going to give you 10 of cups here. But high priestess card, you did not use your intuition here. Your intuition was blocked here and you did not see that whoever this person was, she was dealing with. What is this? Ooh. Hot cakes. You got three wands. They were orchestrating your own moves here, and you didn't even know what's going on. Pay the source, and it was a page in damn self. Talking about you, gossiping about you, spying about you. Whatever they said they weren't going to expose, they still told them motherfucker business, so they still exposed their ass, okay, and put their ass in the dirt. Period. It's just period here and cause their mess of fucking time on me here. Now six of swords, they want to look all crazy and shit. And guess what? Two of cups energy. They want to come towards you or apologize towards you. I say that they start coming to call the waters with you here. But with the world card and justice, their cycle has closed out. I'm getting like, you know, bitch, you, you the magician here. And they trying to come through like, yeah, you got some of that, that magic. Or yeah, you still fuck with me. You know, we still got, uh, uh I'm hearing going steady by Rocco. We just be kicking it. We ain't going steady. Like, they want to see that you still got that shit. Man, you know I'm ready. Like, here they come. Now the swords running in after they was hangman energy. Had you in the hangman energy. Had themselves in one, too, with the eight of wands. Yeah, all because they're working with this person here. And when they come towards you, they're going to tell you what they're working with. They're playing and everything to get with them. you going to know they're the nine of wands the whole time. But you be in this nine of pentacles energy with the ten of wands. You're not going to want no burdens, no emotional shit, no, none of that shit. You're going to choose the Eight of Cups. Walk away, go towards your happiness and shit because the person lied to you or she when they could have just told the truth because they got overwhelmed. Okay, they couldn't take the heat, so they had to get out the kitchen. I don't know. I'm picking up fire sign vibes. We got Scorpio. We got Libra here. We got Scorpio. We got Pisces. All right. Um, got Gemini here. Got heavy water sign energy in this thing here. Heavy water sign, heavy fire sign energy in this thing. Okay. But, um, yeah, this was the reading. I ain't gonna make this too long. But, yeah, child, this is the fucking ghetto. This motherfucker's gonna try to come back and be cool, y'all. They hoping that you take them back. They hoping that you'll be cool with them. They hoping that, you know, they can go into karma waters after exposing you or, or doing you dirty. Okay? So, this was the reading. Be on the lookout, and I will definitely see y'all later.